At the first no cooling call of 2024, I'll come across this heat pump, which has absolutely no refrigerant. All hooked up, but nobody's home. So let's hook up some nitrogen and see what we can find. Here, let's see what we got. Dang, you hear that? Yeah, that's uh... There's something going on in there. Sounds like the nitrogen is whistling out from the inside, so let's go ahead and pop this top and see what's going on. But I need to set up a canopy because it is about to freaking pour. In that little bit of time, all the nitrogen is blown out, so let's put some more in and find that leak. Shouldn't take much. Yep, it is loud. So where are we? Is it right here? In the beef joint? Oh man. Look at that. Yeah, focus. There we go. Dude. Rub through, ground it out, blew apart. Now that we know what the problem is, I can go ahead and hit this thing with a torch, pull a nice deep vacuum, and fill this thing back up with refrigerant. So before I get the torches set up, I definitely need to flow nitrogen through, through this system. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna set this regulator, urge, breeze. Now, this thing is gonna control the PSI of the nitrogen through the system so that when I put a flame to the pipe, I do not end up with carbon deposits on the inside of the copper. Absolutely amazing product. Now we're flowing nitrogen, got the high side open, took that hose off, it's just gonna let the pressure out so it doesn't build up and give me a problem. unit held pressure so let's go ahead and let the vacuum pump run it's going to take a while since it is pulling on the compressor and we'll come back and make sure it's good to go thank god uh i was dropped off a canopy or else this would not happen with the weather or what we're about to get in this area so the vacuum is finally under 500 we are reading 468 right now which means we are good to go on the vacuum and the rain just started what I need to do is I need to weigh in the refrigerant into this system. So we've got the field piece scale. We've got the take a 410. We're good to go on that. Luckily, the line set is a total of 25 feet. So charging the system just by weighing it in is going to be super easy. I won't have to spend a ton of time because I do not want to keep the head pressure high by uh, leaving this up. If it's also raining, the equipment is not exactly cheap. So uh, let's get started with that whole process. Tag state's 175 ounces, zero dot tank. Let's get this started. This might take a while, but we're going. And we are running again, so I just need to adjust the charge while the system is running. Here's the thing, it is about to freaking storm. So just to let y'all know, this thing is done, it is working. 
I'm gonna put the camera down and actually get out of here before the whole freaking top gets blown away. So this is what I was hoping to avoid. It is just coming down. Ah, thank you for watching. Thank you for yeah. Thank you for watching and sticking out with me. And uh, hopefully, I don't. Recording at the perfect time. See y'all later.